Welcome back to Web API Tutorials. I am Venkat. In the previous videos, we have seen creating role table and role privileges table. In this video, let us create foreign key relationship between these two tables. And these are the two tables, role table and role privilege table. So role privilege table has role ID and let us create the foreign key. Here this one is the role table. So one role can have multiple role privileges, right? So public, virtual, high collection of role privileges. Okay. We have created collection in role table. Let's go to role privilege table. This one is the role privilege table. Here we need to create public integer role ID Okay, role ID is already there. We don't need to create it separately. So if the role ID is already there, then we need to create role role so role privilege is always assigned to one particular role okay so now let us go to the configuration role privilege has this one so let's copy this configuration from student sorry student config so we need to add this one foreign key relationship copy this from student config and go to the role privilege config and add it here so here instead of department it is the role role privileges and role id and here the foreign key name should be role role privileges and roles okay we are creating foreign key between role privileges table and roles table Okay, we have added the foreign key. Let us let us add this migration. What we have added? We have added one collection in role class, and we have added this role record in role privilege table. And inside the role privilege config, we have added this foreign key mapping now go to package manager console and select your project and paste that add migration command and creating foreign key between role privilege and roles press enter build started build succeeded migration created here you can see creating index and foreign key okay and dropping it and similarly let's take the update database command paste it and enter database updated let's go to database and these are the columns earlier and here you can see foreign key is created and here you can see the mapping id in roles table role id in role privileges table is mapped for more videos like this please like share and subscribe.